Greetings and salutations, my fellow guide eaters. My name's The Corrupted HD, or you can just call me Eddie for short. This video is about the damage comparisons between the base gun and the bullet editor, and the current in game weapons that you may or may not have at the moment. Uh, by request, I was asked to show the damage comparisons between the base weapon that you use in a bullet editor and current weapons that you may have right now. First off, I will say results may vary depending on the weapon that you get, the stats that come on it, and whether you have it reinforced or not. I'm going to go over all the weapons in this video this time, starting off with the assault gun. I'm using the charge bullet, and at the base it does 72 damage, and I believe earlier yeah, looking back on it, it did around 450 damage. I do want to say again that results may vary depending on your weapon and its abilities. And actually for the assault weapon, we actually have a new bullet recipe to go over. It's a tri shot that has uh, orbs on it that actually shoots about six lasers at the target. It's called the X-ray bullet. I picked this up from someone that I played with online. And this bullet in particular uses the dispersal replica bullet. It actually shoots three bullets out of its own, and it actually has three different uh, orbs that you can use to aim lasers at your target. It's actually pretty cool. It's pretty unique once you use it in game too. Uh, the damage numbers is 1720 when all of them hit at its ideal targets. And at its base level, you'll see that it does, let's see, about 274. Granted all, the, uh, granted, all the lasers hit their targets properly. I did try to do the math in my head, but then I also came to the conclusion at the end that uh, there's the stats and uh, whether it's reinforced or not, or just the natural affinity of the weapon, it does change the numbers around. So. Like I said in the beginning of the video, results will vary. And that will just about do it for the assault weapon. I'm showing off a uh, Omni bullet, oh, an Omni healing bullet that I did make. All it is is just a status recovery, putting uh, attack and defense buffs on there with the blood chips available. And moving on into the beastly god weapon itself, the blast gun. Uh, the flame of ruin bullet that I used in my uh, original blast gun video, I have there. And let's see, with the base gun, it does 1392, and I believe at the max for my shot, for me, it did around 10,000 damage per shot, you know, if it hit in the right place. But unlike my last video, I actually showing off a different variant of the Meteor Shower Bullet that I did, well, I did get from someone else. Uh, what it is, is it adds more deco lasers, and as opposed to just a meteor dropping it's a meteor shower you know, it looks as if it's raining as it's about to decimate the origami and make them run initially this doesn't change the actual damage numbers of the bullet itself you can make the normal one it's just that this one adds a little bit of flair to it and at the base it does about 2040 damage give or take some Moving on to one of my personal favorites, the HDH bullet. At the base damage, it does 1583, and it does actually it doesn't take off that much of your OP, so you are able to use one, at least maybe one or two shots at the beginning of the game. Well, when I go back to my end game, it take oh, it takes less, and it does over 10,000 damage. Moving over to the sniper section, we've got the Mole Pentabomb Bullet. At the base, it does in flat and even 2,000 damage. Uh, when I turn the base gun off, for me, it does over 10,000 damage at the very least, 13 to 20. Next is the legendary IOD Bullet, and at the very base, it does 496. Uh, whenever I turn my base gun off and I uh, don't have a crit on, it does 3279, but it, do, it will do even more with the sniper critical on. Look at that. If you got an extra about 500 damage from there. I did try changing the, the, the dummy's body type to see if it added more damage to it. Uh, it, added, it did add some in some cases. Yes, it did. 
now I'm going over the loop bullet um, at the base damage it did 688 and this is hitting other parts of the origami body and I'm moving on to A it actually did more damage somehow I guess having the body there makes it do less damage but uh, with the base gun I'd go into at least eh, I'd just say 5,000 damage estimating give or take a few you know And this will do it for me, guys. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I know it wasn't exactly the most informative video, but considering reinforcements, natural stats, uh, elemental multipliers, uh, I can't give you a perfect estimate, but at least I can get you put in the right direction with this video here. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like. Uh, tell me how you guys can make my next video better. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.